Hello, welcome to Fun Game Reviews. I wanted to share with you guys how to keep Tanker's Crosshair permanently on your computer. Every time you start up the computer, it will do it for you automatically. So, first things first, you can go and download all his crosshairs from this page right here. Uh, we'll put this in the description down below for you guys on YouTube. So, after you guys have downloaded it, what, what, what it will do is it will show up in your downloads folder like so. So, this is how you basically start. So, you can go to your desktop. Here's some examples that I've created already. But let's pretend we start new. You click on right click on your desktop in an empty space and then click on text. Okay. So, you can call this tank tanker. And basically, when you double click it, it will open up as empty text. All you have to do is use the word copy, like copy three times because you're going to copy three files, right? So just to give you a, an example, when you do this and you copy, you will now go to your downloads folder and just right click on the three file names that you got. When you right click, you just click copy as path. Now, you just copy and paste it, or you can right click and paste, or control V. Okay, and then you do the same thing for the next one. You just copy as path, put it here, and paste. And then the same thing for the third one. You just copy as path, paste. So this is where, where you're gonna keep the, the crosshairs forever. Okay, you don't, if you ever delete these, these will no longer work uh, on startup. So you just leave them in your downloads folder, and that's it. So the next thing is, uh, what you want to do is on the bottom, you click on the search and type in Roblox. So this is you're going to right click this and you're going to click open file location. But this is going to first take you to the shortcut. So you have to right click again and click file open file location. So it actually takes you to your user app data directory where Roblox is installed. Okay, and under that, it's going to be under contents, it's going to be under textures, and it's going to be under cursors and keyboard mouse. So you can see the, 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 the files that we downloaded are named exactly identical. So you just right click again, click copy as path, and paste it right where you want it. So this is going to be doing the overwrite method for these two files, right? So you're going to overwrite how the keyboard looks. And basically, right now, these are Tanker's crosshairs already because we've already done that. But every time you reboot the computer, it always resets this. Okay? So the next thing is, you can say, okay, uh, if you want to do the mouse lock cursor too, you go back to the texture section. And you go all the way down where it says mouse lock cursor right here. And you just copy this path. And you paste it. And then you just click File, Save. Okay? So once you've saved that, you can see that on your desktop, you can double click it if you want to. It shows you that you've already set it up to, to go do that, right? Oh, I actually named it tanker.txt, right? So let me just go and delete this one. This was me just doing a trial so that you guys don't have to like see, see that. But let's just say I copied again. So one thing you want to do is you want, if you don't see the file extension type, click the three dots here. Click on Options, click on View, and then you see where it says Hide Extensions for Known File Types? You just have to uncheck it and then push Apply. That will make it, so, and then you can say Apply to Folders. That way it will apply everywhere to everything on your computer so that you will see all the file extensions. So now, after you have it to .txt, you can just click it again and change this from .txt to .bat. It'll say, if you want to change the file say, say yes. So once that's done, you can actually just double click it and, and basically launch Roblox. And you will see that the Roblox uh, cursor looks like this. Like even if you zoom in, even if you shift lock and stuff like that. All right. And then here's another thing. What you can do to make it so it's fully automated. Uh, so that it will stay permanent for you, you can open the search menu, click Task Scheduler, okay, and you can actually just type Create Basics Task and call it Curse, C 
cursor tank curve. Okay? And then the next step is you click on this and click when the computer starts. So this way it will run it every time your computer starts so you never have to run it manually. And if it doesn't work, you just run the batch script manually. And then click next, click start a program, click next. And now you just go look for the file that you renamed as tanker.bat, right? And then you click next and you click finished, that's it. So every time your computer reboots and stuff like that, it will come back and it will automatically apply the mouse settings, the, the cursor settings for you, and that's it. You can close everything now, go ahead, restart your computer, you can launch Roblox, whatever, and you'll see that this, this is done. So thanks for watching. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and share. If you really enjoyed this, let me know down in the comments below. And if you guys need any other tips of how to, how to automate things, so that you guys will have better gameplay in Roblox, yeah, let us know. All right, thanks for watching. Bye-bye.